हेलो फ्रेंड आई एम पराग गुप्ता एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज अबाउट टाइम एलोकेशन फॉर इफेक्टिव रिविजन ऑप्टिमली वी शेल स्टार्ट रिवाइजिंग अलॉन्ग स्टडीज एंड वी शेल मेक श्योर दैट आवर रिविजन इज कम्प्लीटेड एटलीस्ट थ्री टू फोर मंथ्स बिफोर एग्जामिनेशन and we shall not involve in any kind of any classes during this 3 to 4 months preceding examination we shall take one theory and one numerical topic at a time reason is pretty simple our mind is fond of getting bored very easily let us take an example let us say your favorite dish is rice if i serve you rice thrice a day for a long time you will start getting bored even by the rice although it was your favorite dish that's my point same is the case of studies let us say you start getting bored with numericals then simply switch to theoretical one and vice versa this will help us in developing continuous interest in the subject further our biggest problem during revision is we start slow and finish fast let me elaborate during initial time of our revision we spend maximum time on first topic which we have chosen for revision and when we come to know that we have already spent maximum time or excessive time on this first topic and we have very less amount of time available for other topics what we usually do we rush we rush to complete these other topics creating a big blunder so best solution to this kind of problem is to make a time table and finalize a time limit for each topic now to allocate time in best manner let us say we have eight subjects let us say we have three months in hand what are you are going to do you shall divide these three months means 90 days by 8 which will come approximately to 11.25 days per subject now if we have targeted three revisions we shall allocate maximum time on first revision and gradually decrease such time and yes please make sure to give weekly off or rest obviously why so let me explain let us say you have air conditioner at your home now my question to you is for how many days can you continuously run such air conditioner your answer might be one day two day a week what will happen after that same is the case for a mind unless given proper rest it will stop concentrating and roam pathlessly to conclude make a time table and stick to that and yes make sure to share such time table with your friends and family to get automatic mental pressure obviously anyways let's say bye bye for the day and yes do subscribe my channel so that you can get similar tips similar videos in future as well bye bye